next. Visit Fort Wayne releases its 2023 report on the economic impact visitors have on the Summit City. The report found in 2022 nearly 9 million people visited from out of town. That's up from 7 million the year before that. Wayne 15's Marcus Truscio is here now to explain what's attracting people to Fort Wayne, Marcus. Yeah, Dirk and Alyssa, some people who live and work in and around Fort Wayne might not think of it as a destination city, but as a hub for entertainment and conventions, the impact tourism has on the city's economy is growing. People are always visiting Fort Wayne to enjoy um, our great leisure attractions. So that is the Fort Wayne Children's Zoo, to go to a Tin Caps game, to go to things like the Vera Bradley outlet sale. That's Kristen Guthrie with Visit Fort Wayne. Her job is to attract travelers to the Summit City. All of the amenities that residents enjoy are things that visitors enjoy as well. She says the majority of visitors come from within a few hours drive. Our top markets that people come to us from are Indianapolis, Chicago, Detroit, um, from South Bend, from Toledo. But Guthrie says some come from much further. Any day of the week you can go into the genealogy center and see people from all over the country who come here to research their genealogy. You may be surprised to learn the number of monthly visitors is pretty evenly distributed throughout the year. In the summer when kids are out of school, we do have more visitors coming for the zoo for a tin caps game, more leisure visitors, more family visitors. And very often we find conventions and tournaments like to meet in the winter months. According to the annual economic impact report, a third of visitor spending is on food and beverage. When we look at spending patterns, Patterns. Uh, a lot of money is spent at our restaurants. Everyone visiting needs to enjoy a great meal and we have plenty of options for them. Guthrie hears great things from people visiting the Summit City. They really find Fort Wayne to be an easy community to explore, a clean community, a welcoming community. Tonight at 6, I'll break down more numbers from this report and how visitor spending is allowing county taxpayers to save an average of almost $800 a year. Marcus Truscio, Wayne 15 News.